on today's video i want to revamp my weave so i'm going to show you the the, the tools that i'm going to use to revamp the, the the weave i don't have all the tools but i'm going to show you the little things that i got that will actually make the process easier it's a channel <laughs> it's a hole it's a hole it's a hole anyway so I'm gonna restart my weave and the one that um actually sew in the weave so I'm just gonna restart for me I'm gonna restart it from scratch and for that I bought a wig cap I bought a wig cap um my lace was burnt inside so I couldn't actually find the actual lace that matched my lace for the hair so I'm gonna use this. I just hope it works. Um, I'll actually, you'll actually see I'm gonna make this work with this lace cause I did burn my lace and the more I comb it, the more hair I lose from the weave. And then I got this brush from, let me actually take it out. I got this brush from everything that I got, that I bought now is from Cosmetics. And then this is from Cosmetics Connection. So I'm gonna use it to to apply the bleach on the knots on the closure, and I also bought this. Um, it's the bleaching powder and the peroxide, also from I mean also from cosmetics, not clicks. Just miss me if I talk about clicks because nothing here that I bought is from clicks. I got this neutralizing hair shampoo to wash my hair and I got this coconut oil I've been using coconut oil um let me check let me just open it because I don't know how it smells okay it just smells like any other you know oil um I got, also got it from with this came not this came Cosmetics child. I got it from cosmetics. I got this um band, stretching band. Um I'm gonna use it for actually making my weave stay on my head like this. So it's gonna be on the wig cap inside and it actually make my weave stay. So I actually had to install the weave every time I had to wait because I didn't have the band that could actually hold the weave in place if i didn't um install the weave and put on the gotsy bit fluid it would move back and just it resist the muscle so yeah and i actually feel like at that time i wasn't i didn't make any research and i wasn't like advanced and i didn't have enough knowledge regarding how to install a weave so yeah this time i'm gonna kill it just i'm gonna do a video and you'll see it and then i bought a measuring tape the only thing that I forgot is to buy a chalk. And I also got the, the food coloring. I got um, pink and blue. These ones I got it from ShopRite. Okay, so the things that I'm about to show you now, they are not new. But I just thought I should include them since um, they are the tool sets. They are the tools that I'm going to need when I revamp the weave, right? You need a silicone head. You can tell it's it's old. That's because I've been using it. And then you're going to need a Godsweet glued or a holding spray. And then you're going to need a conditioner. This is an old conditioner and I'm just... It's just a small amount and then as you breathe, it will be finished. So thank you so much for watching this video. Till we again in another video. Bye.